Flight QF696 to Toronto will be boarding in 5 minutes. Please make your way to the departure. is Ryan Dunholm. Welcome to the Laffy Laugh. -laugh. You're going to have a great evening tonight. Uh, we've got a lot of great comics on. Uh, very surprised to see you here, actually. I would have thought what you'd be tonight would be in the warmth of somebody's crotch. But uh, you're here, and that's great. That's fantastic to see. Now, I'm one of those guys where, after about 10 minutes of watching me, you're going to be sitting there thinking, you know, I don't really blame lesbians. <laughs> found out that uh, going to the washroom can give you AIDS. I found out by trial and error, actually. Uh, I had a bet going with a buddy, and we were trying to see who could get AIDS the fastest. Yeah. Turns out that it was eating hamburger off a toilet seat that worked. <laughs> or it could have been the uh, pigeon. Pigeon. P it could have been the pigeon bought an ice cream that I uh, had for, de for dessert. Uh, or it was the dead dog that I made out with on the way to on the way to work. It, anyway, I just w I won the bet. <laughs> My name's uh, Christian Reimer, and um, in Canada we have the proud and mighty beaver. <laughs> <laughs> the beaver is something else. It's a big floppy tail and teeth and a and ah! I'm a dangerous animal. I'm a dangerous animal. That's what he said. We'll be back in May. We want to see you make everyone laugh. <laughs> you can't understand a simple joke, can you? You know nothing about 
comedy. You're too young. would still applaud if you knew what my penis looked like. It's like a hamster. Cute but furry. <laughs> I actually went to see uh, Puppetry of the Penis the other day. It was alright. When I was in the bathroom in the intermission, all I could think was, man, my dick is so boring. <laughs> Just stuff comes out of it and that's basically all it does. <laughs> Hey, yay. Hey. How are you? Ah. It's not good. Why? Ah, it's just so much crap. I don't really want to talk about it. Have you had a bad day? Yeah, not anymore. You look tense. Yeah, it should be. It's really nice. This is um my first time. Oh. It doesn't mean we can't, you know, I just want you to take it slow. Oh, but maybe you're not ready. <sighs> what about you? There's no way you deserve that spot in Montreal. What? You're stand up. For God's sake, stop being so freaking rude and just be funny like you are at home. And when are you gonna answer your mom's calls? Stop calling, I can't afford international roaming. Isn't it a rite of passage to deflower a virgin? It sounds so beautiful, doesn't it? Deflower a virgin. I don't want to deflower a virgin. I want to tear, tear her hymen open. It, look, if you knew who I was talking about, 
you wouldn't be looking at me like that. Why did I have to get caught in tonight? Let me give you a bit of an illustration. Uh, basically, she looks something like this with no top on, except a little bit less hairy. <laughs> How's that for quality entertainment? A man in a bra. Hey, I was the one who wasn't ready, okay? Right. Like, look, it's not even about sex. Hey, why don't you come to Montreal with me? You sure you don't want to come to Montreal with me? So you'd rather have me come and take the piece? I'm actually moving into an apartment in Toronto this afternoon. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah Canada. Come visit sometime. 